Hello everyone. Today I'm going to be showing you the FLIR M232 night vision camera tied to the Raymarine Axiom. Let's go check it out. It's on a Tiara yacht. Alright, so here's the unit here. Slide your finger over for powering up. A quick story behind this boat here is a uh, went with a Garmin 7612. Eventually, we're going to be doing the whole system in Garmin, but uh, the software wouldn't allow controls to the FLIR M232 yet, so the customer opted for the Raymarine. Axiom unit here as a uh, temporary fix, you could say, until the uh, Garmin software update is completed. Okay, so here we have home screen. Very nice. Okay, okay. Of course, you get your chart, fish finder, radar. None of that's hooked up. Your charts work, but uh, there's no sounder or radar hooked up to this unit, strictly for the FLIR. So I'm going to go ahead and touch the FLIR icon there, let that load up, and here we have picture. Okay. What I like about it is uh, it's touch screen so you can scroll around with your finger like kind of like an iPhone or an Android. Um, it does have pinch to zoom. Kind of difficult to use sometimes when you got frozen fingers but there is a uh, plus and minus down here for zooming in um, some of the other features I like are the uh, record button you can actually record video onto an SD card or the photo button you can uh, grab a snapshot and save it on SD card as well um, as you can see there's someone walking down the uh, dock there pretty cool um, some other features I like are the different palettes. You can choose the palette you like. You can do white hot or red hot or fusion. Um, you can also do different scenes, kind of like a preset. You can do a day setting or a high contrast or whatever. Um, you can also flip the image vertical in case you install the camera upside down. In some applications, that's necessary. Um, clear cruise. That is a proprietary feature to Ray Marine. It um, basically it highlights objects in the water that it detects as motion. Um, you can't get that on your Garmin or your Furuno with this camera. It's kind of a uh, special feature just for Ray Marine. Pretty neat. Uh, let's see, camera motion. Another feature I like is the scan. So if I enable the scan here, oh, I'm gonna slide it. Okay. Let's do a slow scan, narrow and slow. And you can go back and you'll see that it's doing a nice slow scan on the horizon it's on currently. I thought that's a really cool feature to have. Um, let's see here. The home button takes your camera right back to the home position that you can program by holding. As you see here, it says hold to set. So if I want this to be home, I can hold that position right there and it'll set that as home. Um, also like the park camera so when you're done or you're out in the daytime not using it you can park the camera and it will hide the lens face it'll point the lens facing down basically to hide it from any debris that might hit it so I'll go home brings the camera right back up good feature pretty nice unit I like it the software seems pretty modern up to date um, Here's the chart plotter maps here. The cartography does remind me of the old Raymarine cartography. A little bit of updates, but uh, 
nothing too spectacular here just a standard short but a yeah, pretty nice unit um, would like to see it with the chart plotter fish finder radar combo see how it looks but uh, we'll get to that one day I'm sure but I just want to give you guys a quick little tour of the Raymarine Axiom with the FLIR M232 just so you can get an idea how it looks uh, thank you for watching please like and subscribe to my channel have a good day hello everyone this is the Raymarine Axiom series 8-7 I was showing you earlier in the video I just want to give you a close up of it it's a really compact unit really nice sturdy construction um, network accessory NEMA 2000 power ports um, I'm really impressed with this unit. I wasn't a very big fan of the old Raymarine stuff. There's your SD card slot there for when you capture pictures and video on your FLIR camera and whatnot. But uh, this new Raymarine stuff since FLIR took over is really leaps and bounds compared to what it used to be. So I'll be sure to you know, try to sell some more of these products so I can see what all they can do. Thanks for tuning in.